The entire tail is aseptically prepared and draped off. The level of the amputation is determined by the extent of the disease and desired margins and a U-shaped or V-shaped incision is made through the skin both dorsally and ventrally. The muscles are transected sharply with either a scalpel or electrocautery all the way down to the bone. Here a scalpel is used to perform the disarticulation between the caudal vertebra. It's also acceptable just to take a bone cutter and transect across the bony structures of the tail. And upon complete amputation, typically the vessels are identified at this point and cauterized off. Any sharp segments of bone can be removed with a rongeur or a bone cutter. For closure, we can just close in two layers, a subcutaneous layer and then a skin layer. Now note that for the subcutaneous layer, I am burying these knots to make sure that there are no knots protruding through the incision. I'm using an interrupted pattern here, but a continuous pattern is also acceptable. And finally, the skin.